stops that your offense was going to have a chance to tie it or win it? Uh, I want to say yeah, but if we play a better first half, we don't need to rely on those situations. So I think it's just we need to do a better job of coming ready to play, and that's all. That's all that all it is. A lot of times we see, you know, in, in a half like that first half, a lot of times you'll see like the offense playing well, but the defense not being able to do it, or or vice versa. How how just how hard is it to get any sort of momentum when it when it's, when it's both sides kind of struggling? Oh. Um, it's hard. You just got to really buckle up and get the job done. Uh, I could make all these excuses, but it doesn't really help anything right now. So we just got to be ready to play and put your big boy pads on and the start of the game, we got to get ready to play. You guys knew it was going to be hard to create a pass for us from him with how quick he gets the ball out and all that, but only one hurry that led to the interception early, but otherwise not much of a pass rush. For sure. Did you how frustrating was that as the game went on that he's dropping back every time that you guys just can't get to him? Um, I guess it could be frustrating, but like I was telling him earlier, we're in position to make plays. Uh, we just got to capitalize and make them. That's all it is. That uh, Watching State's got you guys four times in a row with this offense. And, and in this one, first half, was it just matchups or, or, or personnel? What did they show differently that maybe you weren't expecting? Uh, Nothing out of the ordinary. We were prepared well. Like I said, we're in positions. We just need to tackle and make plays towards the end of the play and finish them. We weren't finishing, and that's all it was. Is that frustrating when you're going against a team that kind of dink and dunks a little bit? For sure. I mean, uh, I don't, I'm not sure they went downfield. They tried to go downfield, but weren't real yeah. successful. But they dink and dunked you to death in the first half. Is that tough, playing that sort of way? 22 minutes of defense in the first half? Yeah, I guess, I guess you could say that. Had you had you guys seen uh, that trick play where they snapped it from the side and got a touchdown? Had, had they shown that on film at all this year? And and uh, like and when they lined up for that, like how do you even uh, adjust in real time to that sort of thing? Oh uh, yeah, we're just we're in position. We just need a tackle. We, we I missed the tackle. Uh, we had it wrapped up. We just didn't take him to the ground, and they scored. What's the flight home going to be like? You know, obviously everybody in the locker room can't be happy right now. Do you, do you guys kind of try to keep your head up, or is it going to be kind of a tough trip home? I mean, the sun will rise tomorrow. We have two choices to really get on your feet and get up, or you can just lay down in bed, you know? So it'll, it'll sting for a little bit, obviously. We lost. I think that's really common sense. But uh, knowing this team, knowing myself, we'll get, get up tomorrow out of bed and get, get ready to go, focus on the next game. What do you think is the biggest takeaway you yourself will learn going into the next game? Uh, just getting ready to play uh, at the start of the game, not not at the second half. Just getting ready to play.